Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn Frozen Wilds DLC. What is growling? What is what? a demonic snap mod? Excellent, cool, cool. Um Oh my gosh, I forget that you can kill birds, can you? Oh my gosh, you can you can't kill birds in the regular game, can you? What I need is a boar, so I can upgrade my resources pack, because, uh... Because I need it. <gasps> oh my gosh, I did it! Oh, is that a badger? I see, I don't, I don't have any, I don't have any room. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Maybe uh, we'll drop the chill water since I can't really make anything with it right now. Nope, nope. Okay, put that. Now, where did I... Okay. I was like, where did I put... Oh, that was the goat, yes. Goat bone. I do need a goat bone for something. I can't remember. Did I already have one? Oh, I have skills. Oh, um... Heck. Yeah, let's do that. What am I trying to do here? Cat ammo capacity. Pew, pew, resources. I need a boar bone for that. I was gonna look at resources and see how many goat bones I have. Oh, okay. What else? Did I need a, I needed like a like a goat and a I think I need a boar bone for the pigments thing. However, onwards. Four. Dang it. Tasty. Mmm. gleam did I need? I know I, needed, I know I needed like 16 for some things, but I feel like I have four now. That ain't, that ain't bad, that ain't sh Oh hey, speak of the devil! Okay, yep. Dang, I needed a lot. Wasn't there something that I... Man. Man. Unreliable and unknown. Oh man. I'm not a gambler, but I'm tempted. Oh, I already bought the. Oh, I need a badger bone. I need two, I need two badger bones. I already bought the pigments one. Oh, look at here, pigments. I wonder what benefit that gives me. They have hunting lodges even out here? Oh my goodness. This is cool. Okay. Thank you, my good individual. It's interesting to have two such disparate parts of like the culture, right? Where you have the clan leader who's like all about like aggressive action, but the shamans are like very much more like spiritual. In like, I don't know, they, if they try, if they do that intentionally to try to like achieve a sort of balance. 
Also, Yellowstone being on fire like that is just really scary. <laughs> being a person who currently lives in the vicinity where if Yellowstone decided to blow up, the shaman's path must be this must be one of the markers mm. that Tuke told me about. Where if Yellowstone decided to blow up, I'd probably die. Activate the ritualistic marker. Via what? Oh. <laughs> Looks like each marker points to another, giving directions. Okay. Well, who As comes in deeper into the cold, creepy ice cave? Who decides? Or who comes back? This isn't the way out. Some gear, though. Who comes back and is like resetting these? this chime for? To help guide the way with sound? If there's more, maybe my focus can find them. How? Yep, focus can pick up the chimes. Should help me find my way. Um... There's no wind in here. How are those chimes going? Check and mate. I just want to pick up some stuff. I took a wrong turn. Yeah, I know. Oh, that's right. I don't need to drop things. I can. It's very annoying about that. Like, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Drummer, weapon, coil. Oh, we have, we have many spaces for those. I don't think I will use... Oh no, we don't have metal burn. See, right now this is all just super basic stuff that I kind of need. Better go back after I grab this loot. I'm running out of space. The light is so cool. The glowing blue light. Very eerie. Could I have gone if I go up there? It's probably a way out. Did I go the wrong way? Oh my gosh, I did. I'm like, it's easy peasy. I went the wrong way. I am so directionally challenged as to be truly not, like, amazed at how I haven't just completely gone off the rails for work. But see, I think I was following that one, but there's... Is that the... Mm -hmm. Am I just going in circles? Oh. I didn't even see this. Oh ho! There's all these sneaky corners in here. Wait. What? What? Is it broken? Are you leading me astray? Oh, I hear... I hear, hear a monster. The chime. Not sure I saw this fork before. See, that's why I keep trying to turn around. Not this way. Um, what? Where? Am I being lied to? 
Oh, okay. I love how the devs like know exactly. It's like, wait, what? And Aloy says it, and then it's like, oh. <laughs> They're like, haha, tricked you. Stalkers. Stalkers. No! I don't have the ability to shoot. I don't have. Um, I don't have tear arrows, so I can't do what I usually do, which is blast stalkers' little invisibility cloaks off. And then beat the crap out of them. This isn't the way out. Hmm. Some gear though. Oh. that not stun me? Oh, they're resistant. I forget. They are resistant to electricity. Oof. Oh, wait. It didn't die. Probably don't need watcher lenses. Let's hope anyway. I know I need like the slag shine glass and maybe the desert glass. I need echo. Well, I need echo if I could ever freaking get um, the dang nab. What's the word? Um, tear blast arrows, but I don't know. Ooh. I should have gotten that. Dang it. I don't know. I got the tinker one, but I should have gotten that. Oh my gosh. This is truly unfortunate. La 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 la. Shell. I can delete those if I need to later. We should be we should be good. What? Where? Is this the way I am supposed to go? I don't know. Oh, there's a chime here, so...
done with the cave. So what's next on this path? Oh -ho. Hey, nice. Where am I? Overlooking that dam. Okay. There's a pigment in there. Cool. Didn't see it. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. What? Oh no. Oh no. What a convoluted dealy wop. Where do we go? Okay. This seems very physically uh, demanding How do I cross this one? for a shaman thing. There it is. Although, to be fair, a lot of shamanistic rituals are actually pretty physically demanding. <laughs> In order to, like, I don't know, separate yourself There's from, the like, the physical realm or something, and then. Oh, no, wait, hang on. And then, uh. Ooh, nice. Was that the... Oh, good. That was the one in the area that I wanted. What? I didn't see that. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, this is the right way? No? <laughs> Ooh, well. Right up. Oh, here we go. I need to pull the rope to move this thing into position. It's a giant puzzle for your body and your brain. I think a lot of the physicality of shamanistic rituals is in order to like separate yourself from your physical body. Like to learn to like separate yourself from it and like engage fully in like the spiritual like realm type thing. Aloy was strong enough to climb up these ropes. Unfortunately, she can only throw herself upwards. She can't inch her way along a rope at a slight incline. So I, so I see that right there. But I also see this. Oh, it's a good thing I didn't just walk over there. Wherefore are you hiding over here? No, oh, oh jeez! Oh, now what have I done? <laughs> huh? Oh, maybe this is- Oh, jeez. That's not what I wanted to do. Maybe that's the way down. Oh my gosh, come on. Eventually. That climbing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Oh no, so now I'm guessing that this was maybe underground, but it's not because I'm obviously above ground, so that's why I can see it now. Uh, but that's unfortunate that apparently at the very tippy end of the shaman's path <laughs> is one of those corruptor things. I don't think, yeah, that'll, that'll play into this somehow. Are you serious? Oh! What is- What is that? It's a gorilla! There's definitely something new out here. That's gotta be- it looked like a gorilla. That had to be a gorilla. <sighs> Chill almost feels like sunburn. Oh. Wow, follow the... Follow the already delineated path. Wild. <laughs> Yep. Oh boy. Is out of that. Mm hmm. Oh hi. Resist freeze. Nice. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff in there. Oh, cool. Oops. No, that's fine. Unfortunate. Okay, so far there isn't a machine over here. Oh, I knew it. The gorilla's gonna come for me. Oh no. It's not that a gorilla. It's got a gorilla body. Wow. Destroy or override the tower is optional. Oh, legit, it just it just hangs out up there. Absolutely gonna get destroyed here. Ooh. I can't get up there. Oh my gosh! Oh my. Jeez. Nice. Now back to 
finding Maria, which means I've got to climb. Let me up. Did I did I break this technically? Okay. Excellent. That was a cool machine. I should be able to get up there. If if only I had more weapons at my disposal. <laughs> I bet on hard that thing rips you apart, like just rips you in half. Takes your health and just eats it for breakfast. As it is, it picked me up and looked like it was gonna tear me in half, and then it didn't. It just like crunched me a little, just a little. Climbing in all this ice would be really difficult. What's what was that? I saw that. Yeah, that. What's that? Is that the sun? Maybe it's, maybe it's supposed to be the sun. Um, can I just? Can I, can I just? Oh, here we go. This must be the shrine Naltuk was talking about. Oh. I guess I should take some blue gleam. Sparkles. I can see why I'm going to it. This is really interesting. So I'm really curious about, like, why this actually forms. Apparently it only forms on machines. Like, freezing machines. I'm really curious what it, what it is. Naltuk said Aurea went past the shrine into the mountain. Wait. I better take those stairs. Where did these are old old stairs? Why are these leading somewhere up a mountain? Is there a is there another dam? Or a mine? An ancient door. Maybe Aurea's inside. Hello? Um I'm afraid, though, I'm gonna have to call it here, I think, because uh, potentially this episode will be too long if I go in there. Uh, but thank you all so much for watching. We'll hop back into this as soon as possible. Uh, really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially my sapling tier patron, Reese Galito. Thank you so much for your support. And an extra special thank you to Christopher, who is my tree tier patron. And he's the super bestest so thank you so much for your support and thank you all so much for watching i hope to see you in the next one